you got this thing where you've 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 met so many of the wrong person that when you meet a right person you know exactly because you remember the the other right person that you thought were boring back in the mm-hmm. days and you were like you let them go and you kind of when you are going through hell with the cycles you kind of regret the good people that you met i mean nobody's good or bad because everybody have have their good side and their bad side but when you are with people who are just not compatible with you on what you're looking for you remember the ones that you like damn i like <sighs> like i like i actually missed or, that or but being and, and it's, it's a question of and it's a question of who you are at the moment you meet the person you see what i mean mm-hmm. there's there's a person that you might meet she's the right person for you but you are not the right version of yourself to yeah. understand that this person is what you need but when you become the right person after burning your wings with the wrong person you when you, you see a post on instagram from that person or, or they say happy birthday because they they still have you in their heart when they say happy birthday you're like oh, damn man could and could've, then could've, could've. so when you meet another of that type of person you're like mm, listen i only meet those every seven eight years ten years i am ready if that so. exactly but you know you said something super important acknowledging the fact that a version of yourself was not maybe prime for the level of communication or maturity that that person was bringing to a relationship because even when i look back bro like there's some people who'll be like oh that mj guy the worst guy you'll ever meet you mm. know what i mean <laughs> whereas whereas like um, somebody else who have a different version of me or they say oh he was the sweetest or whatever um, but at some point I was not the good person because of maybe my defense mechanisms or experiences mm-hmm. like that because trust me that whole three day silence thing I know that game way too well it is taxing man it's yeah, it, it takes a lot away from you bro mm-hmm I, I would say that um, I don't believe that I have people that that believe that I was a bad relationship or have bad memories. Most people I met, I was I'm so honest about everything in life yeah. that it might have been brutal at that time because i always said hey listen i'm here for this this way that way and i don't lie though that today they're like well listen this guy was honest about what he wanted or what he was about so and he was always respectful so it it yeah it makes a it makes a different uh I, i don't have like bad karma following me like or i don't have things that i have to pay or whatever i had to pay to karma i paid i paid i felt it i was like all right okay all right he came back oh yeah I was like, well, <laughs> uh, okay <laughs> do you take the credit card <laughs> so you but know. you see i get i kind of get that though but i think for me it doesn't really I would I wouldn't say it exactly the same way. I actually think at some point and it might be any reason. Like say I've broken up with someone when they were not ready to break up with me, but I mm-hmm. didn't give them a chance to try and save it. I because when I'm done with something, I don't look back. I'm just like I'm out. Yeah. See you. So I am pretty sure there are people with unresolved feelings oh yeah that associates my name to it if you know what i mean well mate the thing is this your unresolved feelings are your issue not mine it's not ours you see what i mean you're cold no (laughs) 
it's not cold what i'm saying listen it is true the things that we share and that we have to talk about we talk about it but then how everybody feel about it is how everybody feel about it have you ever been in those situations where you're done with somebody but you stay because you don't want to hurt their feelings yes it's yes worse. your honor it's worse <laughs> it's actually a worse situation because the more you force yourself to be there the less you there and at a point yeah. you cannot be there jail, right like in the and in the beginning you, you're not there you cannot be intimate with that person anyway you just want to leave you're probably thinking about somebody else but that's another story um 